watermelon water. What's up everybody, it's Adam for Rando Reviews and today I'm going to review some watermelon water. Now this weekend I was at Walmart in their spoiled fruit section and I walked over to where they have their juices looking for coconut water. They had no coconut water but I found this watermelon water and I said, you know what? That sounds delicious. I should probably review that. Now, I immediately took notice of the price tag on the item. It was $2.99 for watermelon water. Now, you can buy a watermelon at Walmart. It might be spoiled, but it's about $2.50, $3. So about the same price as this bottle of water. Now, I've never heard of this. It sounds awesome. So I thought, hey, I should buy that. I like coconut water. Maybe it's like the new trend is to uh, take a fruit and then make it to a water. So I got the watermelon water and I took it home and I just started reading this bottle and I want to share it with you. It says it's cold pressed uh, watermelon, deliciously hydrating. But here's where the kind of innuendo comes in. And I think they might take it just a little too far. It says, say what? A hydration sensation spreading love to the nation. Each melon is conscientiously grown, non-GMO, hand skinned, cold pressed, tenderly loved. Say when? Every time the thirsty, dehydrated, electrolyte starved, nutrient famished, cells in your body beg for some loving. Morning? Yup. Workout? Uh-huh. Post-party? Never better. Rejuvenate the watermelon way. Yep. Uh, it says everything but the skin, no water added because if you add water to watermelon, that would just be redundant. Um, but it says it has uh, way more potassium than your favorite sports drink, uh, about the same sugar as coconut water, 45% less than OJ. The brand is called We Grow Water, which is a little weird to uh, say the least. But um, yeah, watermelon water, I think they're trying to get with the uh, sexual innuendo to make this be the sexiest drink since Zima. I don't know if that'll be possible, but we're gonna try it right here on Rando Reviews. It's it smells exactly like watermelon. So there is, there, you can tell there's no additives whatsoever. It says the ingredients for watermelon flesh. Who's so sexy? Watermelon rind and organic lemon. So there is some lemon in the watermelon water, which seems uh, strange. Maybe give a little bit of uh, uh, acidity to it. So let's try it out. Watermelon water. Oh. It's not as good as I expected. It tastes like they got a watermelon, whole thing, dumped it in a Vitamix, turned that sucker on 15 and gave you and strained it and put it in a bottle. I like watermelon, but that's a, that's a weird aftertaste. Um, I mean, it, it's, it's definitely got the watermelon flavor, but. I mean, rind is, it's edible, but it doesn't taste good. And it tastes more like rind than the watermelon itself. So I'm not sure if that's a good thing. But uh, you know what's crazy is in a 10 pound watermelon, you get about a gallon of water. This is 12 ounces. Now it would take about 10 of these to get one watermelon's worth of water. So take that math, which I'm too stupid to deal with, but $3 for one of these times 10. So you're basically, this is like 10 watermelon, or a 10th of a watermelon for a 10 times the price, something like that. So $3 for a watermelon, $3 for this, you get 10 of these for 30 bucks or 30 watermelons, and you'll get 30 of the, ah, it's too much math. Just, I guess what I'm saying is watermelon water is, it's okay, it's got a really strong watermelon flavor, which is good, but I think it's too much rind taste. Uh, I would say stick with coconut water, but if you want to try something new, watermelon water by We Grow Water. So clever. It's seed free. 
That's a positive. Ah, this just makes me know how I'm not healthy because this is probably delicious to healthy people. To me, it's I would rather have something else. But watermelon water, go pick it up at wherever. I got it at Walmart, America's grocery store. That's it for this Rando Review, everybody. Hope I got a watermelon mustache. We'll see you next time right here on Rando Reviews. See ya.